My name is Anne Mark. My husband and I always meant to travel, but we never found the time to go away. Since he died, I've managed to go out on my own and quite enjoy it, although I wish he were here with me to see all these wonderful places. I went on this trip to Jordan because I've always been fascinated by the Middle East. I arrived in Jordan's capital city, Amman, and began journeying through the mountains into the desert. One morning I was fortunate enough to accompany two of the desert patrol policemen out into the desert. I wonder if they'll let me ride on their camels. Now, it doesn't sound as if the camel's very happy. <laughs> OK, left, up, one, two, three. Uh. Whoa! Uh. OK, hey, that's not too bad, is it? And you sit down here. Okay. This leg round here. Yes. 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 This yes. leg over here. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I don't know whether I'm ready for this. <laughs> oh! Oh my goodness! Oh! <laughs> oh when I reached Petra, I was assigned a guide. His name was Harun. We took horses down the Seek, which is a narrow passageway. This is absolutely amazing, Haran. The rose red city half as old as time is the phrase that describes it. After the treasury, Haran and I dismounted from our steeds and walked down another seat, but it was a wider one this time, with uh, an old theater on the left and on the right some other temples. One was called the Urn Temple that we climbed up to. I was fortunate enough to be introduced to a Bedouin woman. We shared some conversation together, although she couldn't speak English and I could speak very little Arabic. Your husband, Muhammad? Oh, he died? Yeah. And when did he die? Two years ago? Oh. My husband, he died to, to say, Sana. No, nine years ago. I saw how happy people were, the very simple pleasures. They have their family around them. They have structured lives in a way, but they know exactly where they stand and they care a lot for each other.